The name of a project is LED scrolling display using 805 bit microcontroller. Um, the abstract is as follows. Um, so when we use a, sim a simple static board means uh, it, is, it is just used to display a single message. So whereas when we want to like um, add or add a new message, we have to delete this previous message and uh, we have to introduce more characters to this. So this is a lot of time consuming and uh, uh, in this case, uh, we can prefer static, uh, instead of static, we can prefer scrolling LED displays. So uh, by using the scrolling LED display, Display with the help of a uh, pre programmed um, controller, we can um, make the LED display in a scrolling way. That is, um, uh, with the help of a dot matrix uh, form, uh, we can um, also make the LED to, to move so that uh, it looks as a continuous um, image of moving the characters. Um, so here instead of using the static one we're using the um, scrolling display so this can be implemented by using a um, dot matrix uh, led so uh, this dot matrix led consists of um, eight cross eight matrix that is um, eight rows and eight columns and uh, all uh, matrix uh, that is a single matrix of eight cross eight it will con it will contribute to a single character so uh, according to our specification we can uh, like include how many of our characters we want but it also has some memory limit so according to that memory limit we have designed our characters so here we are going to use six uh, we are going to display six characters that means we want to use six matrices and um, as we can practically see this uh, the uh, scrolling boards are like uh, more uh, used in um, places for providing informations or in uh, airports or airports or in railway stations uh, and also in a uh, bus to provide the uh, uh, routes of the next uh, uh, stop so the software which we here we are using are uh, kale microvision software for uh, writing the program code and um, protease software for seeing the uh, for, for seeing simulated version of the output so now let us see how to write the code in the Kale Microvision software. Uh, the code written here is converted into a hex file so that it could be uh, dumped in the Protea software. So now let's look, uh, take a look at the code. So here um, we are going to print the word um, PEC ECE. -E. So um, we have uh, declared some functions here um, in order to um, make the program uh, work. And the, uh, the all the uh, functions are uh, put in a while loop so that um, the word can be displayed again and again. And so, um, uh, so this is a code for a, a letter P. So uh, here we are making use of eight cross eight AED matrix so that um, according to this, according to the matrix, we have uh, taken uh, ports one and two. Um, from the microcontroller 8051 as the input and output ports respectively and at the end of each uh, letter we have added some delay so that uh, the letters could be um, uh, viewed easily so the same follows for E um, and C so the same uh, here is for E, C and E so now um, we are going to save this project and uh, if we uh, build this project there are so no errors and warnings so now let's uh, take a look at this simulation part so now we have seen how to write the code in the kale uh, part so now let us simulate the program using the protease software for simulation part here we have taken you uh, we have taken um protease uh, software and we have um, taken um the microcontroller 8051 and the 8 cross 8 LED matrix and similarly we have taken ports 1 and 2 as input and output ports and now if I uh, run the program we can see the letters are being displayed as P, E, C and uh, E, C so E C and E. 
so um, we can add many more letters according to the specification we can uh, use and this LED and our uh, applications of LED scrolling display boards are as from follows so as we uh, saw earlier we can use this in uh, important places for displaying informations and also we can use this um, as a simple outdoor LED message uh, using the scrolling board and also like um, in uh, electronic projects for uh, scrolling the generator for outdoor digital signs like uh, uh, to display the output we get and also we can use this marketable LED sign board so uh, we can also implement in various uh, other technologies we can use thank you